Listen, yeah, I'm back with another video after a couple decades. Um, just had to take a break, see where I went, the direction I went to take the channel, take a step back, take a breather, and I decided that I want to take it in a more dance direction and talk about topics that are directly related to dance. Um, you know, the others were, but they were too broad and I was getting too bored myself. It was kind of getting hard for me to think of more ideas that were broad and fitted dance and life. So I decided to just go for dance. Um, now I understand I have like viewers that are dancers, non-dancers, but um, I'm hoping maybe you can take the message and apply it in other areas, but I'm not gonna be talking about life and dance because yeah, it was getting too much, it was getting too much and it was hard to find um, topics to talk about, so. Yeah. Oh, oh, is that what you're telling them? So you're not lazy now. But anyways, um, today's topic is going to be about patience. And I believe that in dance, for me anyways, personally, I feel like da in dance, patience is, if you could have three top things in dance, it, patience would be one of them. Patience is key. Um, it's it's like, almost like a, a motto or, so, or a mantra, something I always think about before I freestyle, to just, just chill. And the reason saying that I say this is because I feel like dance is a conversation between you and the music, yeah? So if it's a conversation between you and the music, you need to let the music speak to you. That's how conversations work. Like, I'm not going to chat to someone and just dominate the conversation. Nah, I'm going to let you speak to me. I'll listen and I'll respond. So, so however you want to explain it, body, soul, spirit, mind, all of that, so it's you and the music. The, the music speaks to you, you hear it and you respond, yeah? But you know when you're in a conversation and you're chatting to someone and they keep, ah, you know when you're in a conversation and you're chatting to someone, they keep interjecting, keep finishing your sentences. Do you know how jarring that is? It's like, it's like they keep trying to interrupt you and that's how I feel like some, sometimes we get like that with the music, like we try and speak over it instead of just listening to the music and just letting yeah, the feeling take, take over. Yeah, yo, yeah. chill, bro. Yeah, like that, like, you know, people trying to talk over you, it gets annoying. I feel like sometimes we try and think too much, think too much, and it drowns out the music to a point where we can't hear it, you know, instead of just letting it speak to us and it responded naturally. So that's how I feel like, um, that's how I feel about patience and why it's so important, because that's how you're gonna start dancing. You need to let it speak to you, you know? Um, so yeah, it's simple, very simple concept. But when you think of it, for me, something that really helped me is thinking of it as a conversation, literal, literally a conversation, like me and me are just chatting and you know, it's, it's just exchanging. And when you think of it like that, it really helps. And just thought I'd share that. And yeah, it really helped me this month. This month has been a, a mad one with the training. But um, thinking of that analogy has really helped me understand it and apply it in my dance. So it, it's like one of the things that I like to go by or whatever. But um, yeah, man, that is it. Um, very short video, but I'm gonna start doing videos straight off the dome. You know, freestyle on my phone. Nah, home alone, Carly Culkin. nah. Is that fun? Oh, man, why are you soaking? Nah, listen, fire. <laughs> Come on. Sit. Oh, hey, I've got oh, fun. Man, like, man, man like but Georgia. Are you nuts? Hey, wow. I'm learning. Ha. <laughs> hey. I'm actually just thinking of what rhymes with learning. Real quick, obviously, it goes without saying, like, patience, not just while you're dancing, but patience in the process, having just trust in the process kind of thing. You know, when people say trust the process, like, just being patient with your work, patient with your craft, patient with the process in it and just waiting for it's not going to happen overnight it's going to take time it's going to take effort um and, and a lot of training so and that's it goes without saying but i just thought i'd throw that in just to tie it in all together you know why why i think patience is so important you know how i said top three yeah i don't think you can rate things but i don't know it's just one of those things man I, I, me personally i just think patience is like Nah, I wanna say I wanna say top three. I wanna say it's one of the top three things for me. Um, but yeah, might change. Who knows? But yeah, thank you for watching, guys. And if I'm hoping you guys like the new style of video, um, 
yeah and that's it i'll see you next week probably not because i'll probably take another two months off <laughs> but yeah see you next week for another vid thank you